today we are making one of those. Ah, ah, ah. Just kidding. Um, we are doing cathedral or church windows, which basically means they're um, like the stained glass. That's what we're doing. So, I'm nervous. I always get nervous when I'm gonna bake with you guys because I don't wanna like lead you guys astray. Um, anyways, let me put this a little lower. I can't even hear myself think. It was pretty loud. I know. We're like, let me just blare that. <laughs> um, okay, let me put this on the apron on. Welcome in, guys. We are doing. If you have regular marshmallows, I'm sure they'll be okay. One time we were making um, wreaths or something with Joe. Hey, beautiful. And he went home to, um, he went to the gas station, he went to the Mexican store to get us some. Joe, come on with your little antler self. Hey. What? Just kidding. He came back with the Mexican, okay, the Mexican rest, the Mexican store had flavored freaking marshmallows. I mean, oh my God, my daughter and my son are like, mom, tell this man something. Hey, Sparkplug Jackie, it is so good to see you, sweetums. It is so great to have you here. Thank you for your blessings. I truly appreciate them. And I felt like I saw you all day today. Hey, Belle Belle. Um, okay, guys. Let me, um, I'm going to just, it's 30 seconds. I'm just going to give a little spiel about my community post. Okay. Oh, Let me yeah. just say this. Hey, Boogie Bear. I came from the drama community. Regardless if I don't do drama on my channel, that is the community I am originated from. Whether I like it or not, I started for about seven or eight months with a very controversial person. All I'm saying is this, and I'm not gonna say a word again. When you see a really, really nice person, be not nice, you'll have to assume that that nice person was somehow wronged. Because I don't want to see betrayed because there was not a betrayal. There was a wrong that was done. When you have one of your children up on somebody's screen and 500 of those people are in that chat who do not know my daughter, calling her horrible names, horrible names, I guarantee you, all of you people that are saying, I thought she was a nice person, I thought she's godly, I thought she's a Christian, let me promise you this. If you come for my kids, you will see the most vicious person come out. I promise you that. You come for my son, you come for my daughter, I promise you, you will not see Oh, pray, let me pray for you and let's have a beautiful day, everybody. I promise you that will not be this person. So don't get it twisted, okay? I am still from the drama community. That's where I came. I don't want drama on my channel because I want a place that I can feel relaxed. I want my friends to come and feel relaxed. That's totally separate from me seeing people who do not know my daughter and them attacking and calling my daughter names and the nasty, the person that was leading that march who had all of her people calling my daughter names, she's to blame. So miss me on, miss me on that I am not being nice, okay? So that's all I have to say. Let's get back to regular programming. And we're back to our regular programming. I don't, I, I mean, there's, I, every one of the moms that are in the chat gets it. And if they say they don't get it, they're lying to themselves. That's all I have to say. If you're a mom and someone comes for one of your children, I promise you, you are a different species that not even your husband, your mother, or any one of your bestest friends would recognize. That's all I can say. When they come for your kin, your child, you will pull out the claws, pull out the blade, and you will come hard. So me, 
saying a couple of not very nice words is very mild. Again, any moms in the chat can recognize and appreciate the ones that are saying they would never. Good, you're a better person than me. I, I would, I would. So this person chose to have my daughter on her screen and calling her names, okay? So all of you guys, my daughter did not sign up for this. I didn't have a channel. I was just a sub and an idiot that I was. I was a sub of, I was a member of hers when she came for me. So all of you members, take just remember that. I was a member, a paying member, when she got a picture of my daughter. So you're not safe just because you're a member there today. You could wake up or get a call that your daughter is up on that screen. All for a misunderstanding. All for a misunderstanding. Your daughter's picture, your son could be up on that screen. And you won't like it very much. I promise that. You won't like seeing your child being attacked. Rachel, you've said the key words. We are done because of that. And she's like, yep, I get it. We're done. Let's make some chocolate. So, Milton, you said something in the last live that made me go, you're right. Go with my moms because that's the one I know. And if that's the one I know, then why would I risk it? Like, I wanted it because it looked like I want to try it. But what if it didn't work out? Well, then I could blame it that it was one I didn't know. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, come on, you guys. All right, all the board people are probably going to be like, yeah, we're out of here now. We thought we were down for the drama thing, but we're not. We don't like it. We don't do the drama. I'm just tired of people saying I thought she was nice. I am nice. I am a godly, nice person, but we have our limits too. That's all. We do have our limits. We need one sixteenth. What? Maybe six, maybe 12 ounces. One bag of chocolate. If you want to use milk chocolate, you can, but I use semi sweet. The reason is the semi sweet in them, um, the semi sweet is offset by the. Um, did you put the thing back on? What's no. What? Yeah? What? The probate, because we wouldn't have got a refill. It's not. Uh... Didn't we take them both? I took. I didn't start anything. No, I'm saying, didn't you take it? I thought we took them all to go get done. Yeah, we, uh, we did two. We took four of them, though. And we decided to only do two. Yeah, we only did two. Okay. I'll get it hooked up for you right now, ma'am. All this hour we're sitting here with... Yeah. No, you guys, Joe sucks. <laughs> yes, this is a full-length woman. This is what a woman looks like. This is what a woman looks like. This is what a woman looks like with a 20-year marriage. Short fatty, it's okay. There's hope for all of you. <laughs> it's okay. You know why? Because at one time, I had a body like Brooke Shields. Oh no, I didn't. She's real tall. Um, what have I ever had? I don't know. But Brooke Shields, I would love to have her height. You know the thing about it, you guys, is that I'm grateful that we still have the flame after 20 years i mean yeah it'd be great to have the the other side of like but i don't know you guys i mean i i've lost weight from what i was um i want to get you know what i want to get this is for all of my 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 subs not for haters this is just for my subs i want to get to a better a better mobility uh I see 65 year old people going out jogging and stuff. And I'm like, man, I don't know if I want to do that, but I know that when my grandson is like seven or 10, like I want to be pushing him on the swing and I want to, and I know I can, but I want to do like, let's go to do the, I don't know, whatever, uh, jogging and let's, I'm going to go and watch his softball. Like I want to be active in my grandson's life. I don't want to be like, I got to take a chair and sit on the side of my grandson's stuff. You know what I mean? Like, that's the thing that motivates me. I know. <laughs> Bell Bell, shut up. That is amazing. 38 years. I got Berkey, too. Berkey's been, like, 
35. I, I love that. You know what? That's, those are goals for me. Like, it's exciting because... Because nobody's perfect, you know what I mean? Because it's like every marriage has the ups and downs and the... Um, I mean, ours was a little bit tougher because we had stepkids. Um, it was tough, you know? And then I had a son who was rebellious. I mean, it's tough. Marriage is tough. Keeping the flame alive is tough. Doing things... I mean, we get along great. That's fun. And I think that's been the best part of it. But there's still the, the, you're not my daddy. You're not my, um, I don't have to listen to you. I mean, he went through teenagers, teenage years. And, you know, he had, um, whether he did his rebellious stage, my husband stuck it through. I mean, I don't know. I don't want to say I wouldn't have stuck it with his daughter, but he didn't have a daughter. But, I mean, I, I, I would have liked the challenge to be there for his daughter you know what I mean? To be a, a role model. And let me tell you that. My daughter, my son says that every day. I'm grateful for the example that Joe set for me. Which, those are like, that's huge props. Huge props, you guys. When somebody, when your stepson tells you that you set an example for him, it makes you feel really proud. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, uh, January 3rd. 38 years for Belle Belle Joe. That just makes me so happy for you guys. It really does, you guys. See, you're still friends. It, it's Some people think it's absurd, right, Belle Belle? And you're just kind of like, um, I wouldn't have married him if I didn't, if we didn't get each other. Like, I wouldn't have married somebody who I was like, oh my God, he's on my nerves. I mean, he has to get on my nerves. But it's more like he gets on, but he really makes me be a better person. Because when I don't feel good, literally, he like, babies me so I almost have to say I don't want to say I don't feel good because I'm going to be baby the whole day he's going to be pampering on me and bringing me things and here have a wet cloth and put it on you and okay guys we're going to start melting our little things um so that part is really 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 good to have that but I mean sometimes I'm just kind of like don't even say anything because you're going to be babied and then you're going to be baby the whole day stay in bed let me bring you breakfast or let me you know let me rub your head does that help your head and does that help you let me rub your back like I love that but I mean you guys some people look at us like no way there's no other person I know some people say the same thing like I like going to bed with my husband. I like laying in bed and talking and laughing. And then I hear other people are like, oh my God, I hope he's asleep when I go to bed. I'm like, How, who says that? I mean, that's kind of mean. Well, first of all, it's mean. And second of all, why would you marry somebody that you don't want to go and, and cuddle up to? And I don't know. I mean, it is, you know what, Belle Belle? I hope at 40 years, me and Joe are still like, we joke a lot, a lot. We play a lot. We we are like, um, we're very, 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 um, we just get each other's jokes. I don't know any other word to say it. We get each other's jokes. There's never been a, like, we just, it helps when you get each other's jokes, not me. We like to cuddle. That's all. That's, I know, girl. Yes, Bell Bell. That's how I am. I love well, he's like, let's watch a movie. I can't go to your arms because if I go to your arms, it just feels like heaven. I just fall right to sleep. <laughs> Try yourself. <laughs> you do this. Look at you go like this. <laughs> I'm going to punch this man. Look at him. He's a mess. Oh, he's a reindeer. Well, yeah. You guys, I'm cutting his hair tonight. I know you guys are tired of looking at it. I'm tired of looking at it. I may, let me take it back, you guys. I said I wasn't tired, and you got it. I've never used a double boiler, so this is very interesting to me. Are you interested? I'm interested. Me too. I'm nervous. Never, I've never seen it done. <laughs> I'd rather do this in the microwave because I know what to expect. Okay, guys, we're boiling this. Joe, show them what we're going to put in it, and you can start putting it in the pan or in the bowl. This? Take it the microphone. I mean the, the microphone. Take it over there. And this. It's one half. We're only gonna do one half a cup of it. I told my mom she better be in here because. This it all go in. Oh, he didn't even get the saran wrap yet. The nuts go in last. So just the right. marshmallows. Just marshmallows. 
Boom. Marshmallows are in. And you got to get saran wrap out, guys. That's important. You got to have your saran wrap ready to go. Ah, don't fall in. Saran wrap. Okay. Being ready. Joe, stop. We got to lay it out, right? Yes, I need to get some of the butter. Laid out. Okay, guys. One stick of al. Uh, I was gonna call it alio, but I don't know the word. So olio. One stick of butter, or half a cup of margarine, or butter. I'm saving my butter for the peanut brittle and other things we're gonna make. Just one. Just one or two. Um, two of them. Like I don't know. Make it wide. Think? I'm gonna make it wide. And it said the best to do is cut your butter up in sections. So one stick of butter, and one bag of your uh, chocolate chips. They're called semi-sweet chips, not the milk chocolate, but you can use them because I actually looked up, does it matter? <laughs> and it said it does not matter because it's whatever your preference is. If you do it in the microwave, you guys, it's probably very 30-second um, intervals. Remember Joe did it for us last time? And whatever you do, guys, you want to make sure when your chocolate is done, when your chocolate's melted, give it about a minute before you mix your marshmallows because it will melt your marshmallows and you don't want your marshmallows melted. You want your marshmallows. Let me stir. No, I'm nervous. No, you're making me even more nervous by staring at me, bro. Hold on. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, hell yeah, it's gonna be hot, baby. Oh, I just got chocolate on my thing. No. I'm trying to get it all that's on the side. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Next time when you're reading the reviews, make sure you see the inch size because apparently I missed that part. <laughs> I, for some reason, thought that this was the perfect size for my little pan. I should have done it in the microwave because I could have used a big bowl. Can you do the, the cut more of this maybe and put it in there? Yeah. How much more? And this is semi-sweet 11-inch bag, or 11-ounce bag. Two more. I, well, I, gotta, I need to use it all. Okay. Thank you, sir. If you're using a double boiler, I would assume you'd need to keep it going until all of your chocolate is melted. I would think that... Oh, I got a cram. No, you're the... You were just dying to do it, it, Joe. <laughs> Look at I got a cramp. Yeah. Look at oh, oh. Pop it out of there. No, I don't like doing oh, that. I hate that when you don't. You All right, I'm gonna start doing the next step, you guys. I gotta stop for a minute. My this part right here has a. Ooh, that hurts. Okay. Back to normal, guys. Um, all this has to go in, babe. One full stick. You just can break right. it down. It's easiest. It? Nope, I got one more square. You can, I, my mom, I think what threw me off is that my mom makes this like logs. And I was going to make one whole log. And I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with you guys. So I'm going to make one big log. This is one bag of, one bag of coconut. And you're going to, this is a little tricky part because you want to make sure that it is, How's it going? Going good. Good, thank you, Daddy. Yeah. My hands were not. I I have bad hands, you guys. My hands like to play games on me. I want to do roll call really quick for everybody. I'm sorry, you guys. It was a little bit of stress right there, and I apologize for bringing you guys into the the yuck, the yuck of it all. I hate for you guys to be there for that. I just, um, I guess I just get tired of people saying, I thought she was godly. And it makes me very upset. Oh my gosh, what is that? Listen to that. 
<laughs> you guys, we have uh, Christmas music on a little bit lower speed, so that's why if it sounds a little cray cray, it is cray cray. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. Hi guys, Berkey. Thank you for being here, love. My mom makes some. She does. Oh, see, my mom makes little tiny logs. Okay. Thank you guys. Thank you, Meltdown. Thank you, Berkey. Uh, Rachel. You are so close. I can see you. Oh, thank you so much, Bell Bell. I pray, I claim it in Jesus' name. I really do. Joe and I had a little bit of a, when we left, when, I don't want to say left like that, but when we were, we, we met when we were out, partied, drank, lived a whole different life. I was 30 years old and just, we had a different life. We partied 24. We just partied. My husband had, he was very comfortable. He worked for a pharmaceutical company. We did a lot of uh, traveling and, and drinking martinis and expensive drinks and things that when I was a single mom, I didn't have or become accustomed to. So top shelf margaritas are nothing. For us to drop four, $300 at dinner, it was nothing. And, and, and then reality was we're dating and we're looking at long range and we wanted to be in a serious relationship, we started going to church. And for us, not for everybody, for us, we chose to quit drinking. We wanted a really good, tight, close walk with the Lord. It was what we wanted to do. This was, again, I would say we we're 20 years, so maybe 19, after a year and a half of dating, we got very serious. And- uh, 12, 15 years. Yes. Of no drinking whatsoever. Yeah. And even now, I don't really drink. Joe drinks once in a while. But, I mean, what, the, 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 what I wanted to say was the transition from us drinking and, and partying and doing, not even, it's not about drugs at all. It's we drank. We drank and we lived a very much uh, life of dropping money and, and drinks uh, was nothing. And then when you stop drinking, you actually find out if you're compatible with a person. You find out if that guy's really funny because he's not, you're sober and he's sober and he's just not as funny. And the jokes he says are not really funny. And you just really what? have to almost date the, <laughs> you almost start out dating all over again. It's really hard to explain. So we actually, and that was like in our two years in, we actually had to figure out how we were going to go and maneuver around oh, our walk and without alcohol, without any, in a, sober, in a sober marriage. There wasn't like, oh, I'm frustrated. I'm going out with the girls or he's going, yeah, well, I'm going to go outside and have a beer. I'm going to go and have a shot. Like we were just sober. We chose it. Nobody else has to. We chose to live a sober marriage and it did take a lot of adjusting a lot of um leaning on god leaning on him to to help us through our marital problems help him and and honestly you guys some people like it some people don't like it but he is the center of our walk he is the center of our marriage he is what holds us together i i have no other word to describe it but he is what holds our home in in alignment um. Let me get a different bowl, right? Yes. You want it to cool. Well, I just want you to take it off there for now yeah. and let it start cooling. Because, nope, I want it in here when it's ready to cool. Oh. So just leave it in there until it's cool. We're going to show them, though. You guys, look at over here. It got smooth. Look at Joe. I haven't lost hope in him yet. So we're going to let it cool for a minute. Because if I put my marshmallows in there right now, they're not going to... um. They will melt my marshmallows, and I don't want them to melt my marshmallows. So anyways, I said all that to say we have come a long ways. We have come through um, a marriage of, of a different life, went through sobriety. It wasn't about being sober. It was simply that we chose to live it. So we didn't mind not drinking. It was that we didn't have that out. We didn't have that out. Let's just, once I get a buzz, he's funny again. And I'm going to go out with the girls and have a couple of drinks, a ladies night. And all that. when it just is a different walk and I'm not, there's no, nobody did right and wrong and how their marriages, our marriage worked like this. We had a son who got into some trouble. The Lord based us. Our daughter went abroad. The Lord based us. 
our marriage was a difficult, the Lord based us. That's it. It works for our home. So all I said, I said all that to say, there's a lot of things that it, it you grow with in 20 years. You grow with your, you get to learn each other. You get to find out things about each other, but you also lean on each other about a lot of things. Hello, my beautiful Sav. Okay, guys, the reason why Joe is, let me just show you. Joe's trying to cool it off right now because we want to mix this in here. This is our um, one half a bag of the marshmallows. It calls for a full bag, but I also saw it with what it looks like in a full bag. So I'm choosing to put a half a bag. I may put the rest of them in, but I'm going to start with this. It's easier to start with less and add to than have a full bag and try to take some out because then I'm going to take my chocolate with it. Okay. So this is, sorry, baby. All right. This is Joe and I want to put this in there, but I want this to, Just to cool it off, guys. Leave that. Leave it? Yep. Okay. As soon as it gets a little cooler, I'm going to mix it up. But if you do it when it's too hot, these marshmallows will go from a circle to, to like, like, stretched. And, and it will and not look like little uh, windows. It will look like... It won't look like stained glass. Yes. But it looks so silky. And this is semi-sweet, so it's a little bit darker, guys. If you guys are wondering, when you guys do yours, if you do milk chocolate, it'll be more of like a dimmed brown. Okay, so Joe, this is, um, okay, do you want to, I think I'm going to have you spread it all the way out, and then I'll yeah. just say hi to everybody really all quick. Right. You want more, right? Yes, I'm going to go, I think, try to do the square, Yeah. No so that way, remember how we saw it laid, and yep. then we kind of pull it on both sides? Yep. Uh, I can't believe Berkey's mom makes them. Um, Oh, Rachel, I can I, I can only imagine that, honey. And you know what, uh, Rachel, my first husband was not like this. I could never have imagined going through my RSD in my hands with my first husband. My husband, I mean, he, if you guys, one of my videos, it shows I went through a domestic violence, my first marriage, and I don't think he could have ever been. Joe opens my water. He... He rubs my hands, he massages my hands, he massages my arm all the way to my elbow. Like, Joe is literally God sent. I, I am truly blessed to have Joe. Mom, see, she says it makes seven or eight logs. Little ones. Mom, seven or eight little logs? Because you're throwing me off. Yeah, Baba, we both did it together. We, exactly. We, I was not responsible. Hey, sir, Georgia. Susan Georgia Peach. I'm sorry. I don't even know what I was going to say. I was going to call you Sugar. <laughs> I'm sorry, Susan. I almost called you Sugar. Well, just know that it was meant with love. Oh, my goodness. I hate to say this, but we're going to lay down because my husband had a cluster. Oh, I'll be praying for you, Belle Belle. Good night, right. love. You have squareness. All right, we are looking for squareness. Okay, I'm so nervous. You think it's? Uh, I don't know. Don't make me nervous. No, I don't think it's 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 cold, cool enough. How do you know? Because it's still like uh, water. In mom, in, how long do you wait when you do it, mom? It thickens up a little bit. If my mom says do it, I'm doing it. I listen to my mama. Show her in the damn. Mom, how long do you wait to do it? My mom's come out beautiful. Mom, how long? Good night, Baba. We love you, Mama. Okay, we're doing it. She said, no. just do it. Don't listen to Joe. What? <laughs> she, <did not. laughs> she said. <laughs> put a marshmallow someplace and put some on there. See if it melts it. Hey, Joe. Just put it right in there. I think it's good. Are you sure? Put it right in there. Joe. Just drop it in. Mix it around. See if it but melts. then you're gonna you're gonna make it. No, you're not gonna make it anything if it's ready. <laughs> I think it's ready. Mom, damn woman, where are you? Come back! All right, you know, give me that thing. Okay, we're doing it. Okay, we're gonna get this. Oh, I think you're making a big mistake. Aye. 
Give me that one. What? That oh, one. oh, oh. Let's see if it's mushy. Okay, hold on. Okay. I'm going to yes. fall apart on you. Okay, okay, here. Mm -hmm. Gotta get nasty. Is it still firm? Still firm. No, is it? It's mm -hmm. ready? Yeah. All right, here we go, guys. I just wanted some chocolate. Oh, my gosh. Mix it around in there. And I would definitely. She's calling me. Uh, can't call on the phone, Abs. How does she not know this? I gotta make sure I can, you all can hear us. She's calling me. Yep, uh, we can still hear. Yeah. Okay, guys. Ready? Wait, put more marshmallows. Put more marshmallows. I'm nervous. Where are they? I don't know. Where on the table. Them? On the in the in the closet. Ay, ay, ay. You want more marshmallows? You uh, I don't know. I want there to be enough. Okay. Here. Mm, yeah, just a little more. Alright. Okay. Good. One stick of butter, one container. There she is. Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> put the marshmallows in before you put it down. Huh? Oh, yeah, I know. She thought I was going to put it there. Uh, no. Mom, I'm not stupid. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> well, it's a good thing she called because I was going to. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Here, you mix it and I'll do that. All right. And like flip it over, like thoroughly flip it. And then I'm going to put the, you, you guys, you can do the, the walnuts as tiny as you want to. You can do these as little powder-ish. I personally didn't want my chocolate to be grainy. Does that make sense? I wanted bites of walnuts in it. So, right. and it's a half a cup of chopped walnuts. Some people choose to do... Do it. Oh my God, do you're it. giving me anxiety. Just do it. <laughs> Some people do um, chopped very fine, but... Just... Oh my God. You're giving me anxiety. <laughs> you're giving me anxiety. <laughs> Stop it. All right. Mixed in. Oh my God, I can't Are breathe. we doing it? We're doing it. Yeah, you're thinking about it. We're doing it. Oh my gosh, right. wait. You know, you gotta put it by a scoop. Put a scoop at a time. Oh, shh. What? We're professionals. Oh. We don't need no scooper. Uh, really? I don't think so. Right there. Are you gonna scoop it? I'm gonna, wait, watch my sweatshirt. It just helps you center it. Yeah, okay, go. guys. Wait, they gotta see. Scoop. Another scoopy. Scoop. Mom says it makes three, but we're making one because we want one big one, Mom. But it looks like there's going to, I mean, need more. No, you're not. I just got to make more higher. Yeah, you're fine. Just so, keep it going. Hey, <laughs> you're awful. Get, get over here. I know, but I want to do this side higher. You'll get your chance. Okay. There you go. Perfect. I can't breathe, you guys. You, you guys, believe it or not, when I do my pumpkin roll, I'm the same way. I get anxiety because I have OCD and I don't want to do things triple, triple, uh, like double and triple to make sure I'm doing it properly. So I like, oh my God, let me do it again. Let me, let me read it again. Can I spread that last mm -hmm. little bit of chocolate mm -hmm. out everywhere? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Keep going in there, all that. We paid for it. <laughs> we paid for your, your chocolate, guys. Scrape your bowl. Don't be, don't be, um... Here, let me help you. There you go. That's okay, it. Something here. You know I ain't going to leave no chocolate behind. No chocolate left behind. All right. Someone say that's racist, but I say it's okay. I'm chocolate. All right. Okay, so this is the tricky part, you guys. Joe, are you going to do it? Yeah, I'll do it. Thank okay. You. Ready, guys? Here we go. Wait, let me turn the what? light on. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. What? <laughs> we need no, 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 no. I do. I want more of it so you can bring it higher. Ay, ay, ay. There's going to be a top and a bottom. I don't want... Who's... Who's is this? Oh, my God. Okay. Let's go back. Who's doing it? Okay, that's true. Go for it. 
And I gotta spread this out so there's no but you gaps. Know, but you, you're supposed to want gaps. You're supposed right. to have it speckled. It is. It's not supposed be to be a tight white coating. That's powdered sugar. Tight white, huh? Oh God, Joe. Oh, yeah, we're going to. Now what are you gonna do with all that? Watch out! Watch out! Just like that. I'm gonna roll it. And bring it. Look at. Watch, guys. Hold on. You're gonna do this to it, and then keep going. Yeah, but no, no, no. Don't do it that way. I gotta bring it back want, this way. I want to do it this way. I, I'm gonna. I don't want to do it that way. You're I want to roll out of. You're gonna. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. You're gonna roll Who it out. Doing it. I'm doing it. Yeah, you're doing it now. You, just, if it you did the hard up, part. Your fault. You did the hard part. Now your I'm fault. brave. Her fault. Okay. Now you're gonna. We need uh, foil or parchment huh? paper or something to wrap it in after this. You do? Yeah, it has to have a second wrapping. That's. Huh. Well, wasting so much of that plastic because it was made to roll the other way it for who for me no because there's more of it was over here it was on this side oh okay i'll remember that for next time well, there won't be a next time woman you'll be doing all this on your own okay and you guys this is one bag of parchment paper i mean one bag of um one bag of coconut if you want more coconut you guys can have more coconut scattered out. We have those sheets, honey, that we bought. Is that where you're going to wrap them in? I don't know. I was just trying to make it easy. I don't know if I'll fit in that because I was look uh, short. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I was going to do that for. Okay, whatever. So you're going to wrap it. Yeah. Or foil. I think some people do foil on it. Wax paper. There you go. Now you're going to roll it again in there? Right? Maybe that way? Whatever way you want. I don't know. Just offer an idea to mm -hmm. get it in there. It's a baby log. We gotta twist these up. Mm-hmm. That's a lot of coconut there. Yeah, it is. What did you do? But I was away. Huh? I was started it. I could have done this for you. What would you have done with all the coconut? I would have spread it out evenly. <laughs> 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 and then grab it and just kind of like tighten it like this <laughs> so that way your saran wrap is getting tight on it you want to bring this side yeah, wow sure. yeah. squeeze it joe get your husband in the kitchen and have him come and squeeze it for you okay there you go <laughs> <laughs> that's not good you want me to get another one yeah. Yeah? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Perfect. Thanks for it. There you go. Or I can grab foil, but I didn't think we had any. Yeah. That's better. Okay, we're going to refrigerate it. Believe it or not, you guys, this is easier than doing a pumpkin roll. A pumpkin roll is stressful. The mom is trying to send comments. Mom, that's a new Joe's phone. I can't see it on my phone. No. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> no. And then... Huh? What do you guys think? Lord have mercy. My mom has been like blowing up my phone going, Yvonne, what are you doing? You're gonna ruin it. And I'm like, mom, I got this. Okay, let's see. Just roll it, damn it. <laughs> I think uh, having, not waiting for the chocolate to get a little firmer. It it's a little harder. In, yeah. It soaks into the, the uh, coconut. coconut. Um, and then. The flavor will be there. Do they, I was gonna ask you. Mom, mom, I'm gonna punch you. It's really easy, my mom. Does it look, I was wondering, does it look good with um, white marshmallows? I wondered about that. Cause not that I, I don't like marshmallow. When it, after it firms up enough, but still sticky. And then we can put more coconut on there if you want. He's too much. Um, I wanna know, do they taste better? Cause I'm not a fan of the red, this flavor, this color. 
Oh my God, my pumpkin roll, the worst. The worst ever. It's, it's not that it's hard, it's stressful. It's a preference. Okay guys, it's really easy putting the wax paper underneath it. Mom, I didn't have wax paper and I wasn't gonna go buy wax paper. My mom's like, I told you to get wax paper for it. I'm not buying wax paper. Sheesh, does she not know? I bought five days worth of chocolate, nuts, blanched nuts, corn syrup, flour, sugar. Hello, mom? She's like, I told you to buy corn, uh, I told you to buy uh, wax paper. My mom. My mom's house is literally like a bakery. She's got everything that you could want in there. Um, I think I'm experimenting with tiramisu. Oh my God, that's so funny you should say that about tiramisu recipes. I've been, I'm kind of brave up to, to try one. Me either, Rachel, me either. We're giving, um, we gave the peanut butter cups to our neighbor. We're gonna, I think, give the other neighbor these because I don't know what to do with them. I mean, we can't eat all of this stuff. We have five days worth of baking that we're gonna be doing with you guys. Oh, my mom was saying to not do the plastic wrap, just to put it on wax paper. Joe, that's what mom was saying. Oh. To just put, don't do the plastic wrap, just put it on wax paper. Okay. Yeah, I didn't do that. I love fresh market rolls, pumpkin rolls. Okay, the hardest thing about a pumpkin roll is that you wanna take it out sooner so that it's not going to dry out but then if you take it out too soon uh, you want it to be the spot it's a sponge cake it's a sponge cake so that's when i made them for the church i mean i probably made about maybe about 30 or 40. you know about oh well i had about two or three weeks to make the pumpkin rolls there were it's just uh, joe loves the cream cheese frosting i don't mind them but let me tell you um, you, after a while, you get to know what it looks like. Let me say that. If on a, a day that, hey, Sumi, when I was baking and I was doing three or four pumpkin rolls, uh, in, in that day, the beginning one, I'm just kind of like, I feel it, the top of it, it should spring back, you want it, whatever, okay? Then you get your cheesecloth or your dishcloth or your parchment paper and you put the powdered sugar on it and you start rolling it up. You just... I don't know. I think I just get anxiety, you guys. I think I just get anxiety. It probably shouldn't be as detrimental, but I get, um, but I get like, did I do it? Did I do it? Did I put enough? Like I start like double guessing and triple guessing myself. Like, did I put enough coconut? Shoot, I didn't put enough coconut or I probably should have put more coconut. So I get really, really stressed when I don't need to be. So that's why I was like, Joe, you put the coconut so I know that we're doing it. You guys, the coat, look. This is our peanut, or um, what are we doing, babe? I'm prepping for our, our um, what's it called tomorrow? For our um, turtles, you guys. I have my caramel that we made. I'm putting them in little discs, and then I'm gonna put them on top of, on top of the pecans and then put the chocolate on top of it. This is an option, you don't have to do it. We want it, this is the caramel we made last night, okay? And it's soft and you can bend it and it's it's just soft, firm caramel. So tomorrow when we make our turtles, we're gonna make some like this. And then we're gonna do some with caramel in here and I'm gonna put the pecans in here and that's a different recipe. We're gonna do, peca uh, Turtles two ways tomorrow night. Does that make sense? But you guys, Joe did a good job. Look, Carmel. Last night's video, he made it for us. I mean, I can cut it into whatever I want um, or warm it up and put it in a, a bowl or whatever. I ate a little bit of it on my apple. Don't hate me, you guys. Jeez. I found a husband who can bake 
and I'm ready to make sure that the food is good enough to give to our neighbor because I don't want to poison the neighbor. I wouldn't have eaten it. I'm doing it just so that the neighbor doesn't get poisoned. Okay? Little discs. Have your caramel ready to go tomorrow so you guys can make the turtles with us. The caramel is on one of the videos that we're doing that we did yesterday. Saturday, we did caramel. Or Sunday. Sunday night, we did caramel. Okay? And then we put it on a cookie sheet. I took it out of that one thing we had. Oh, yeah, yeah, Penny, I got to read what you're saying. I got to read. You guys are just have, like, stories. Hold on. I've been experimenting. I know, girl. Yes. We need to email each other, and I want to know your tiramisu that you came up with. Both of them taste good. That's good to know because I really wanted the white marshmallows. Rachel, I can't wait for that to be finished either. Isn't parchment paper waxed? Um, it's, it, it, it's waxed, but it's, um, it's not thin enough. Wax paper is like just thin. Parchment paper is just more of got a, a, a firm, um, a stiffness to it. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to have a favorite one. That's funny. You know what, you guys? I never tried tiramisu because I didn't like coffee. And then Joe's, we, we, you know, we went to eat different restaurants. And he goes, have you ever tried this dessert? Do you want to share one? We always share desserts. And I was like, no, I don't want none. And he goes, just try it. My gosh. Never should have tried it. Because that is my ultimate, ultimate favorite dessert is a tiramisu. Well, you know why? It's because, well, well let me rephrase this. Some of them are crazily coffee, and I'm not a coffee fan, just like I don't like cinnamon, but I love tiramisu. They just have to be, the mascarpone has to be just right. Mm. Daddy, can you give me? What do you I was talking about how I had tir uh, tiramisu the first time oh, and yeah. how much I loved it. But then one, they put so much alcohol in the express. What kind of coffee is that? Espresso. Very, very strong. <coughs> and I couldn't even bite into it. Remember that, Jay? Close that thing. What? I'm not going to do anything to it. Sue me. Uh, my daughter's Christmas presents. Oh, my God, Charlie. You are a good mother. Hmm, that is a good mother. She's giving the, her daughter a stand-up mixer with new baking pans, measuring spoons, cups. Charlie, do you need a daughter? It's okay if we're not the daughter's mother age. Like a KitchenAid one? Yes, a stand-up mixer. Glass candy. Is that like rock candy? Yeah, my mom used to make rock candy. My mom almost lost her finger. It took off all the skin off of her finger. She was like, my little brother was in the kitchen and my mom looked down and the hot syrup stuff went on her finger and her initial reaction was to pull it off and it took all a whole chunk of her meat with it. It just instantly hardened to her finger. Hi, baby. Hey. I expect her to bake a lot of things. I love that. Olive Garden has the best. Olive Garden's tiramisu is good. I'm with you on that. My only issue is that it requires raw egg yolks. It kind of freaks me out. Biscoff one has no egg. I'm willing to try any one. Raw eggs freak me out, too. <laughs> you guys, I eat raw dough. I eat raw dough. Everything from cake dough, cookie dough. I eat sugar, chocolate chip, cake mix, white cake mix, chocolate cake. I eat dough. The only kind of dough I don't <coughs> eat is like, um, what is that called? You want a coffee, Dad? Uh, I'll make one in a little bit. The, um, uh, what is it called? Like cinnamon dough. What is that dough called? Is it just called dough, right? Yeah, sure. Like you put, you roll it out and you put cinnamon and sugar on it. Yeah. Is that dough? Yeah. Well, what is it? Oh, cake mix. Cake mix, cookie dough, but not bread dough or anything like that. It confused me, actually. I wonder if anybody's ever got salmonella. Oh, this is what my son said, because he's like uh, in the kitchen and my brother. They said, people think that you don't get salmonella, but a lot of times people just chalk it up as an upset stomach or 
they, something didn't sit in, well in their stomach or they, um, they have diarrhea the next day or their stomach is, you know, just not, not sitting well. Those are just an, er, a very light sign of salmonella. He's like, people just don't realize that it just has different layers of it, different levels of it. You know what I mean? I was like, whatever, give me some of that cookie dough now. All right, I got to see what people said. Blah, 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 save, save, grateful. Lord. Oh, it, you are truly blessed. Just. You guys, you know what the best part about, um, this is what I have to say about Joe. Joe is a good guy. I'm the first to tell you that. But it, it, there's a lot of, like, I appreciate Joe. So that's why I have to appreciate what I went through in my first marriage. Because if I didn't have that, that I went through, it wouldn't, look at you guys, this has been on my neck the whole time. And I've been looking for my glasses and they were right there. And I have my other ones. Um, if I didn't go through what I went through with my first husband, then I wouldn't have the reality and the realization of what a good man Joe is. You know what I mean? Like some people, I mean, who wants to go through the DV and all that that I went through? Nobody, obviously nobody wants to go through that. But if I wouldn't have gone through that, I wouldn't be able to say that my, um, you know, like that my uh, overcoming, having this now is so great. So I had to go through that. You know what I mean? Yes, I saw something about food poisoning, love. I'm running, you guys. I'm running. Uh, thank you, Milton. <clears throat> hey, Novi, don't be doing that. It makes me nervous. Yes, Penny, please send me the recipes. You put alcohol in yours? Is it good? I've, I mean, I've, I've had it with uh, that espresso. I think it's like an espresso coffee liquor. A coffee liqueur, that's what it is. Yes, Penny, that is true. <gasps> Shut up, Penny. She said they are very, a lot of them are mild, but it almost killed my husband once. He got an iron tummy and immune system. Oh my gosh. It almost killed him. That is scary, Penny. Holy crap. Glass candy. Is it a Christmas kind? I shall find out. Yeah, it is rock candy. Oh. Glass candy. I think it's rock candy, love. It's like we called it glass we called it rock candy in the um when we were in school, um, like the cool moms or whatever had the the, she, the girl would come in with a little like Ziploc baggie and what it is is basically like sugar and you make it into a rock and you put food coloring in it and then you put um uh it hardens like a thin cookie sheet you put food coloring so you can have watermelon apple whatever cherry and then uh once it hardens you put food coloring and flavoring so once it hardens they're all like different jagged pieces. And then a girl would come into school and had a little Ziploc bag and she had like all full of the candy. And it was like, so one of the girls always made cinnamon, always made cinnamon. And it just stank to high heavens. <gasps> you guys, I had, oh, you guys, you guys are a different part. Of, I don't know if there's any people from my other drama community. A lot of you guys are from the crime community. Well, anyways. Do you know how hard it was to find Red Hots? And I wanted to tell you guys, because my drama community knows about Red Hots. Um, Milltown, you know about Red Hots. Okay, there's a certain person that makes um, cinnamon apples. Instead of putting cinnamon, she puts Red Hots. Charlie knows about this. Okay, so Charlie's here. So, I don't know how this person finds Red Hot candies. Because we went to so many stores to find them. And I was like... Um, I don't know. They must sell them everywhere in another state, but our state does not have Red Hots. I looked everywhere. Everywhere. Hello, Texas girl. Welcome. Texas girl, what's it like where you're at? You don't have to tell me where you're at, 
But where I'm at, it was like 58 today, 55 today. <sighs> I know, Penny, I know, Penny, I know. Yuck. Why not, why not just put cinnamon? What is it going to hurt to put cinnamon? I mean, just put cinnamon for the love of Jesus. Put cinnamon in your apples. Who puts candy at 50 in your... You know what? If my man liked me to put milk duds in it instead of putting this, I'd probably do it. So who knows? Maybe her man liked it or something. Speaking of, you know how much... This is a little hack. Everybody gather around. Come in. See this? Okay. I got these like this. I, this is before Joe made my this. I got this. Hey, Dave. And I put it in the microwave for about four or five seconds. And it came out. And I threw a pecan on top of it. And guess what? She is a smart woman. I had a very quick little... Uh, turtle and nobody had to know a thing it was a little secret in the kitchen going down with me and it was wonderful i don't do we have a walgreens in in liberty hill i don't know we austin's huge right. i could probably find some in austin we live out in the country like country that there's not even wi-fi that people have to go to the library and rent hotspots to have Wi-Fi. Not lying, guys. But we used to use our data and do our, our lives. And then uh, one day, some somehow, I was at the library. And then I was dropping off a movie because, again, there's no Wi-Fi. So there's no towers. So that way we can watch on our uh, uh, RV. Um, girl, yes, I know they're awful. I know they are, Dave. But, should I just show you guys everything we're making? Okay, guys, come on. Stay here. Don't leave. Joe, you're on camera. What's up? Joey. I'm looking. I'm watching. Hi, guys. We got so many, so many, so many, so many things that we're, okay. I can't read anybody's comments now, so I'm sorry, guys. I have my my pecans prep for tomorrow because we're making turtles, whole ones, pieces, okay? We're making two separate. Yes. Hey, whoever, who two is separate. the one getting a mixer? Oh, I don't know, babe. You said someone's getting a stand mixer. She bought one for her daughter. Oh, okay. I was just going to ask her what time she's going to get because it uh, depends on the wattage. Oh, yeah? Yeah. It's Everybody Charlie. can handle. Charlie, look into it because some can't handle certain things. Yeah. You might want to get the, the, the non-tilting one. Get the non-tilting one. The one's a professional. Okay. It goes from like 325 watts to like 525 watts or more. There you go. This is for peanut brittle. We're making peanut brittle. We're making an almond bark. And then we have... Our pretzel rods we're making also. These are for our wreaths. Uh, can you grab this box? This is for our almond bark, I think. This is for our rods. This is for our rods. Went through hell and high water for these. These go with this and this. Is that it? Okay, peanut brittles one day. And I have my Kero syrup in there. That's Kero syrup. Oh, and then my turtles. 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 That and that are on one day. Peanut brittles on one day. So Tuesday, Wednesday. Tuesday, Wednesday. We're making Christmas crump. Uh, things. We're making Christmas crack, you guys. Tr crimes in fashion. Wanted me to make. Christmas crack. So I'm going to do the Christmas crack. Hey, freaking fabulous. So that's another one. So I'm trying really hard, you guys. Um, we're going to make pretzel rods that are going to be Christmas decorated. We're making a Christmas crack that's going to be Christmas decorated. And then we're making an almond bark that's going to be decorated. One bag. Okay. And then we're doing 
um, wreaths. I don't know if anybody knows what they are, but we're just making four things in one day. And then this is the turtles are one day. This is our next week, you guys. This is our week coming up. You think peanut butter would be better with walnuts or almonds? Um, I don't know. There's, they call one something like that. You could. I think it's just preference. You think so? I think so. I don't know how the, the, the walnuts will act because they get, they're soft. I'm going to separate these two. I don't know. I wanted to, um, there's five days. I've used one thing today, so that's one day. Um, we're doing, I don't know if anybody knows what it is, but it's like a Christmas crack. It's like the pre the crackers, toffee, and then chocolate. And then after it sets, we're decorating it with some, uh, like, Christmas, this. With Christmas decorations to make it a Christmas uh, crack. Christmas crack. And then almond bark with almond... And then we're going to decorate it with that. And then peanut brittle. Oy, oy. You guys, this has been an eventful. I just want you guys to have like, if you have kids, y'all can do the wreaths. I don't even know. Like, I talked to two people here in Texas, and they didn't even know what wreaths I was talking about. I, it might be just a Midwest thing, but I mean, I don't know. Yes, in Jesus' name. That is it, you guys. That is what I said. We are getting it before the end of this. The end of this year in Jesus' name. I've claimed it. I've claimed it, and, and I, I'm claiming it. I don't even know what others to say. We're claiming it in the name of the Lord, we'll and he is going to. Yes. We're trying. Now, no, we are claiming it. we got over 400 yes. videos out there. I know we're we've still done, we're still kicking. The, kicking we've done four hundred videos, out. you guys. Four hundred videos. We're doing a beef stew coming up, enchilada soup coming up, tuna casserole coming up, Salisbury steak. Uh, um, what kind of beef tips? Noodles. What did I call that? Um, stroganoff, mm -hmm. but also beef tips. <sighs> we're doing it, you guys. I mean, we're doing it. It's just going to take a little work. I mean, you know why it feels like um, like a huge thing? Because there's a lot of, like, sometimes when we're, like, really exhausted and we're like, oh, my gosh, we got to go live again today. We have two more things to cook. And then we can have off on the weekend. Like, we really, 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 really want to get... Um, God, there's so many people that ask, whether it be an email or they ask if I know how to make things. And I feel just selfish, not, not taking up. Let me just go in there real quick. I'll show them how to make it real quick. Let me just go show them real fast. It's, it will take 15 minutes max. And so I really, really get so, um, I don't know, I get it all pumped up. And I want to go in the kitchen and like when Berkey, Berkey goes, oh, the next time you have a chance, I'd love to learn how to make sweet tea. And I was like, say less. I'll be in the kitchen. Meet me there in 30 minutes. She's like, wait, what? And I'm like, no, I'm, I'm going to the kitchen. We're making sweet tea. Okay, guys, how, it's, it's probably not anywhere near ready. It says it takes an hour, but I think it's going to take more than that, don't you think? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty big. I want to just rub it out. It we out should have done it separate so that we could be, uh, to firm it up. Yeah. Okay, because we did it, my mom said I should have done it in two, two, two logs, but man doesn't listen too well to anybody. You have to show me, Joe? Ooh, it looks so pretty. Can I take this one off? Oh, it's already getting hard on this side. Mm -hmm. What are you laughing at? Not ready yet, but it will be ready, you guys. We're gonna freeze it I again. Wait. Next time, I would definitely wait to put the chocolate in there until it cools down a little bit more. more? Yeah. Okay. So it doesn't soak in. There. Right now, would be a good time to put more coconut. coconut. We, that's all our coconut, bro. Oh, it's all. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, we're not taking anything off yet. Just, yeah, just let it sit, baby. Okay. I don't want For to... another video. <laughs> You guys, I'll, I'll, I'll do a, a live if it's later on tonight, but don't worry. 
doing that. What? <laughs> I don't I'm using it. I'm trying to get it the same size. <laughs> You're just thinking bad things, Joe. <laughs> yes, you are. Don't be thinking things like that with my cooking. So just get out of the kitchen. This is my cooking. Hey. Just kidding. I was just gonna say puff puff pass. <laughs> What's that one movie? Y'all, sorry, 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 sorry. I'm still in normal. It'll be done tonight. It'll be done later. Yeah, it's only eight o'clock, you guys. A big, big Christmas. What freaking? What's a great idea? I keep praying. <gasps> Rachel, stop it! You're the sweetest person ever. That's <sighs> so sweet, you guys. I'm. So, I love that. You know what I love? When I see Berkey write something, and she says our channel like literally it's gonna bring me to tears because i love that you guys take ownership like it's all of ours and i saw her put it somewhere i don't remember where she commented something about our channel and i want her to feel i want all of us to feel like that and it made me feel so um i'm so grateful that you guys see it as ours like all of ours i don't get it i didn't I didn't get here without you guys. Every video, I didn't get here without you guys. You know what I mean? You used to do bushel baskets? What's that? Filled with homemade cookies. Mm. I want, okay, have you guys ever seen my mom makes chocolate covered cherries? They're literally the cherry, and then there's like a white, the white thing, but it actually is like, um. It's like a little bit of putty, and you wrap your cherry in it, and then you dip it in the chocolate. So before you dip it in the chocolate, it is a little white ball. It's hard to explain. But the white ball is actually got the cherry inside of it. And the little white thing is actually she makes that. You like them, DBS? Okay, we'll make them. We'll make them, dude. We'll make them. Oh, my God, no. Why? Because they're gonna be this too hard. <laughs> too hard. Joe's so stupid. So you're pushing. <laughs> We're busting at the seams. <laughs> it's like, holy shit. You're gonna make me pee. My brain is going to explode. <laughs> you're so no dumb. idea how to make this. You're so it's dumb. candy. It's confectionate <laughs> stuff. It's like hard to do. Joe's, I'm gonna be right here. <laughs> what are you doing to us? We're going down you're the like, tubes. Like, We're going no. down fast. Man the lifeboats. <laughs> She's going down. Today, Joe is like, Joe's like, babe, we can't be making stuff oh, like God. this. He goes, We're not chocolatiers. <laughs> yeah, we're not freaking Oompa Loompa stars. <laughs> My mom. I gotta Wonka's go to the bathroom. <laughs> All right, dead Sorry. airspace now. Yeah, I'll go. just sit here and Joe talk to them. You caused this. <laughs> you caused this. What? Mess. Means I have to go to the bathroom. Oh my lord. Come on, get in, girl. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. We're not doing no chocolate covered cherries, man. Just ain't happening because it's too difficult. We might try it off camera before we put it on camera. That's what I'm saying. There's got to be something in here. Talk to them. I'm talking, I'm talking. All right, well, what do you want to talk about? <laughs> yeah. She's, you know, she's the talent here. I'm just the backup guy. I'm the helper guy. I'm I'm like the, the what do they call it, the, the main oh, grip. That water. Head, head grip. That's what oh, yeah. that means. Who's talking, Mom? No, I don't know. Hi, Mom. Uh-oh. I see they need to sit for a few days for that to happen. What? What did you say you wanted to happen? I have no idea. Chocolate, chocolate covered, covered cherries. cherries. Oh, oh, okay. No, no, no. No, not happening. No <laughs> yes, chocolate covered cherries. We are. See, these things are going this way. <laughs> They're going this way, not this way. You guys, you know what this is on? It almost gave me third degree cuts, like to go to the hospital. Look at Third degree cuts? Yes. Holy smokes. Uh, Berkey's... Um, fry maker that she sent us, the chopper that she sent us. What do we use it for? Fries. No, you and used it for... Potatoes. I'm going to punch you. <laughs> you used it for the mandolin, for the onions. For the onions. She 
She was, she got <laughs> cut on the fry thing. On the fry thing, you guys. The damn things are sharp. Mom, get back into the damn live. Yeah, what do you, hey. We're not making the damn chocolate. We are gonna make them. Chocolate Devious likes them. Devious done. Say less, mama. Say less. We're gonna do it. When you go to Devious' live, when you go to Devious' live, her husband will call and they're talking on the same time. Literally reminds me of me and you. Devious is like, get off of there. Nobody cares. I love your It's so funny. You're like, nobody can don't do that on my oh, it's just funny. Mom goes, I am here. <laughs> <laughs> Mom all talking back to us. <laughs> Mom. She's all multitasking. She's multitasking. My mom is too funny. Anyways, you guys. Um, I'm gonna get that recipe for you, Dev, and we are getting it, you guys, as a whole. We are <laughs> Mitten Mama's Mama, <laughs> Penny. Mitten Mama's Mama, get back in. We have to do the, the, the lint thing. It goes, oh, chocolate. <laughs> the beautiful chocolate. Like, no, it's not us. Yeah, it is us. We're doing that. No. What is that That chocolate guy on YouTube? Lint. How do you know? Lint chocolate. He's no, the chocolatier. that's not him. Yeah. They stir His name it is goes, Lint. Uh, no, he's on a commercial. He's just a chef guy. Oh, you know, I love it. And he said, Sh I like carving the chocolate. Oh, no, that guy. That's it. Yeah, that's what you want to do. Yeah. yeah chocolate We're doing it. Covered cherries now, today. We're doing it, We're baby. We're doing like uh, dinosaurs and dinosaur eggs. I kept tomorrow. you guys long enough, but the next Matt time. carving's this big. Yeah. It's like, just guys... making this for you guys. Whoever <laughs> wanted this. <laughs> Mona Lisa and freaking David. We're going to carve this up for you. It'll only be about 19,000 hours. I know. Can you imagine how much they charge? Oh, we just cut his head off. Oh, we'll get back to you. <laughs> oh, nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. We're shot for tears. <laughs> okay. We're, okay. You guys, I love you guys. Um, Tomorrow. Caramels. I almost said, I almost said, candles. Because oh. <laughs> my brain saw... I was gonna say caramel, but my brain said camel, and I almost said. Watch your, watch your. Uh, you know, oh my god, you guys! I almost <laughs> said. Okay, you guys know I don't know how words ever. Okay, in my head I was like, we have to make caramel, okay. But in my head I saw camel, and I almost said, camel. You guys, I don't know why. I don't know why my brain does not know words. It knew words. I was like, mm, mm, mm. and now I'm like, when did you they go? You can say that. Why? You can say that, but you can't prove it. Why? <laughs> that you knew words at one time? I do. I did. How? Tell me. <clears throat> Show me. What? Show me the receipts. <laughs> <laughs> receipts are going to happen. <laughs> Show me the receipt. You're stupid, Joe. I gotta go so I can punch him. <laughs> what is wrong with our dog? Prancer, would you? Look at I punch Donner and Blixen. Look at our dog. She's just staring at us. Yeah. Yeah, she is. This is what we have staring at us, you guys. She wants to know she when we're gonna give her a treat. She wrote F U D on the on the, on the refrigerator. With <laughs> <laughs> <And> her paw. <laughs> our dog our dog wrote wrote food with his paw. <laughs> she doesn't know how to spell yet though. Oh my gosh, Joe. Alright, we're gonna go. We're gonna give oh. Alright, we're gonna go. Okay. Hurry up. Come on. Sit down. Careful. Gentle. Gentle. <laughs> Look at Bailey's. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey's all serious, Joe. <laughs> Bailey's you like just this. just blew everybody's eardrums out. Sorry, you guys. Bailey's like this. Yeah. Nova? Don't Bailey. give Nova Nova, one stop right now. now. She's being naughty. You guys, look at how good Bailey is. She just stares. Stares and waits and drools. You're a good girl, huh? She's a drooler. You're a dirty little drooler. Joe! <laughs> no time to play, right, it's baby? Bacon. It's bacon. Is it bacon? Bacon, 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 bacon. It's bacon! Good girl. You gotta be gentle. Gentle with mama. Bacon, bacon, bacon. You be bacon, gentle bacon, with bacon. mama. Bacon, bacon, bacon. 
It's gentle. Bacon. Give her bacon. Wait, gentle. Good. There you go. Gentle. Uh, gentle. There's a good girl. <laughs> She's so gentle. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Good girl. Oh, she's a mess. There's she's a mess. Okay, guys, Those we love you. Those are the girls. girls. When, you, when you sign up for membership. Dude, I don't know why. <laughs> Camel Joe. Camel Joe dipped in chocolate. <laughs> hey, now. Joe, shut up. <laughs> hey, now. <laughs> I don't know why my brain. A new Christmas. <laughs> I was, was going to say caramel, but. Oh, like new Christmas tradition, babe. Like my, um, I was, I don't know why. I have to look at the word. Uh, that I'm about to say, and that's a lot of times when I am at a loss of words, I don't, I, it's not that I'm at a loss of words, I'm trying to read it in my head. Like, it's just weird. So I'm like, in my head, I'm going, why does it say camel? And then I'm like, camel toe? And so that's why I'm like, no, not, like my brain had to go, no, not that, it's caramel. I don't know, you guys. I, this is what happens when you're 50 years old and things are like, <laughs> Nothing makes any sense anymore. I love you guys. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna tomorrow. We'll was that come? We'll, we'll like we'll come back and meet like that tonight. You're gonna. No, it'll be done tonight. No, tomorrow. No, tomorrow. When we're gonna meet back up. Commence. That mean or something? Yeah. I guess Commemorate. So. No. No. We're like we'll meet back Good. together here. Um. Uh, Commence. Until we meet again? We'll commence. No. No? Mm -hmm. no? Something like that. We'll commence. We'll congregate? No? I don't know. It sounds something like commence. But tomorrow we'll commence. <laughs> I don't know what word my brain is thinking, but it's like that. We'll be back. We'll it's be probably back. Camel toe. Joe! You can't say That's that what word! You're about. <laughs> God, Joe just made that word dirty. Devious, your man makes your channel hilarious. And then cherry. what you tell him is always hilarious. Cherry. We shall tink Camel tomorrow, toe. Camel Toe. <laughs> is there a similarity here? Oh, we didn't, we didn't tink with the caramel. Oh, yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Well, let's do a piece. Did you take all the squares? Yeah, I did. I put them in the thing. Give me a knife. Bring it over so you can see them. Come on, guys. Here's Hello? What is this? Oh. Yeah, good idea. It's perfect. That's all. You gotta cut better? Yeah. Okay. It's like a candy bar. If I had a Granny Smith apple, it'd be going down. Tink. 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 Caramel. Ooh, look at that. A piece of caramel uh, candy. Uh-huh. Dude, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. I after I after I learned how to make it, or Joe learned how to make it, I will never make caramel. I will never buy caramel again. It's just it's so different. It's so, so soft and it's so like yeah. buttery. Um, it's like, you know. I mean, look at how soft it is. I'm sending but some you to you. Cut it and, you know, use I love it you guys. Whatever. Have a blessed week, you guys. Stay safe out on the streets. Tomorrow we make turtles. Two different ways. Well, I know, tomorrow it's so good. We make turtles. Joe. Yeah. Why is it so big, bro? Because I just took another piece. <laughs> I love you all. Oh, freaking, it's so good to have you, Mama. It's good to have Penny, freaking. Devious, Rachel, Mom, Berkey, Milltown. I know you're in here, Charlie. Um, I love you guys, all of you guys. You guys are such a blessing to our channel. Everything that you guys bring to the table, your stories, your jokes, everything. Your, your... Those taste better than the caramels that you buy in individual ones. Yeah, they really do. Mm. My dog... My dog loves so yes. when you have your babies on the screen. Oh, shut up. She says my dog 
who loves when we put our babies on the screen. Uh, I love that girls. so much, Penny. They're good girls. For the most part. Can't wait to for women moose tracks for men. <laughs> I love you guys. Bye. See ya. Oh, share us if you can. Get us to subs. the... Um, we need subs. We need... Uh, yeah, I was going to say, get us to the... 75 half, that, more. That, That's it. To the home stretch. 75 more. In Jesus' name. It seemed impossible when we only had 75. I know. I know, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> I like, really did. I was like, oh my God, once we get to 100, then we'll feel it. Then we got, you know, 80 and then 100. And we're like, oh my gosh, once we get to 150. I think I felt like 200 was like forever. Right, Joe. Mm -hmm. When we were like waiting to get to two hundred, mm -hmm. it felt like, oh my god, I'm gonna go against this man. Bye.